Hey everyone, Adrian here from RME. This time I want to give you a quick rundown of a feature that every RME user should know about and it's called loopback. Loopback will increase your workflow tremendously and it will also boost your creativity because it turns your RME interface in a very sophisticated digital patch bay. So let's check that out. You will find loopback on every output channel and there is no distinction between analog or digital outputs in Total Mix FX. Loopback will work on every output channel. So you'll find it under the tool icon and then there is loopback. And once I activate loopback, every signal that is routed to this particular output channel will be sent back to the respective input channel, meaning I have output channels three and four, and every th signal that is now sent to this channel will be sent back to input channel three and four. So let's do that. I have selected upper three and four, and I set my voice now to the submix three and four. But you see, even though we have activated loopback, that there is no metering. And why is that? Well, input channels in Total Mix FX work in a specific manner, and they just show levels when there is a physical connection, meaning analog inputs or an ADAT connection. So just because you don't see any metering doesn't mean that there is no signal going to this input channel. So keep that in mind when you are working with loopback. To capture the loopback channel, all we have to do is go to our DAW, select the loopback channel and press record. <laughs> 